In this video, I'm just going to show you how just a small adjustment to the fro can really change the accuracy and consistency. Uh, on this example, I'm throwing at double tops and I just wasn't hearing it consistently. And as you can see from my setup here, um, my arm or my elbow is not really aligned with kind of my left shoulder as I'm throwing. There's almost an angle there. So I'm going to show you a few in real time and a few slowed down so you can see that. Again, right there where my elbow is just pointing outwards just a little bit. That forearm just isn't quite parallel or horizontal to the floor. Parallel to the wall, if you like. And lots of them were just going low, very inaccurate, very inconsistent. So I put on the uh, video and just started to just slow it down just to see why it wasn't quite going right. And cat cut is actually really good for this because you can put your videos in there, you can cut them up, slam them right down, put them all back together and then you get a bit of a montage of before and after. So this is after now. After I've watched the video, I've noticed that basically there was that angle. I was thinking, right, okay, so I need to straighten the arm up. But by straightening the arm up, it was almost coming into my line of sight. So that was a bit of a worry because then I was looking at the dart rather than the target. But by just uh, playing about with it a bit and focusing in, you can see there now the, the forearm is almost directly pointing up towards the ceiling. And then straight away, the accuracy was so much better. And although it felt like I was blocking my vision, I could just lower the dart enough so that it didn't, and it didn't block it. And as you can see now, the follow through is also a lot straighter. It's still not perfect by any means, and I'm still not hitting double tops every time. But it was a small adjustment that made a big difference. And yeah, so that's my video today. So I'm going to leave you with the adjustment and throw in the dart a little bit better. If you have made it this, to this point, it's probably good for me to say that I am actually left eye dominant throwing right hand.